time you lift up Jesus, he will draw to you whoever needs to come to you. He did not say, call people. What he said, lift me up. When I am lifted, the help you want will come to you. When I am lifted, every person God ordained to be in your life, he is the glue that attracts things to you. So your primary task is to do what? Lift Jesus up. Lift Jesus up. Lift Jesus up. Every time you lift up Jesus, the devil will locate his level. Because Jesus and the devil cannot be in the same place at the same time. Just lift those hands to him this morning. So, say, Holy Spirit. I am all yours. Just tell him, Holy Spirit. I'm all yours. There is no spirit of the enemy that can stay in this place. Jesus is here. Jesus is here. Jesus is here. In the presence of Jehovah. Lift those hands to him. God Almighty. Prince of peace, trouble vanish. Every spirit of setback must live your life this afternoon. Every spirit of the enemy, whatever doesn't belong to Jesus, whatever doesn't belong to the kingdom of God, Whatever is of the enemy must leave you alive this afternoon. Father, in the name of Jesus, every stranger that has been bothering the lives of your people, every stranger been drawing them back this afternoon I order you in the name of Jesus you must leave the people of God every spirit of enchantment every negative spirit every negative word that has been spoken over your destiny to draw you back, to fail you, to oppose you in the mighty name of Jesus. You must live their lives. Say, Holy Spirit, I am all yours. 
Tell him, Holy Spirit, I am all yours. Say, Holy Spirit, this body belongs to you. This body belongs to you. This is not the house of the enemy. I belong to light. I belong to the kingdom of his son. I don't belong to darkness. Whatsoever is of darkness must live my life now. Come on, take off first. Say, whatever is of darkness must live my life now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lord, you say it in your word. No enchantment. No divination. No witchcraft. No works of the enemy. Shall prevail. Over your children. Whatsoever has been working against you. it off your life. Witchcraft. I break it off your life. Ancestral bondages. I break it off your life. Whatever has been pursuing your life to draw you back from where you came from. I break it off your life. Say, Holy Spirit. I cannot hear you say, Holy Spirit. This body belongs to you. This is your house. 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 this afternoon you, you say it in your word you will carry your sentence with speed and finality this afternoon your servants have been waiting on you Kolaba, I release the fire of the Holy Spirit right now. I consume every work of the enemy. Right now! Every chain, every fetter that has been drawing your life back right now, it breaks off your life! Say, Holy Spirit, this body belongs to you. Jesus. 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 Say, Holy Spirit, every stranger in my life must live now live now live now live now live now live now live now, live now. every manifestation 
of evil in your dreams. Every demonic manifestation of the devil in your dreams. Dreams of witch texts, dreams of dead people, dreams of snakes, dreams of reptiles. Wherever you are right now, you are leaving the people of God. You are leaving the people of God. You are leaving the people of God. Say, today is my day of liberty. Here he say, today is my day of liberty. Say, today is my day of liberty. Say, today is my day of liberty. I come against every curse that was spoken over your life by your uncles, by your aunties, by witch doctors, by men to cause you not to go beyond a certain level. You have reached a place where you cannot increase, you cannot expand. Right now, I break that limitation of your life. I break that containment of your life. Say, every stranger, live my life now. Say, every stranger, Live my life now. They are living. 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 In the name of Jesus. Every spirit of setback. Every spirit of setback, every spirit of setback, let my people go. 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 It has reduced your business to zero. It has taken away your relationships. He has taken people out of your life. Right now, that operation of evil. That operation of evil. Must live your life now. Must live your life now. In the name of Jesus. Say every stranger. Is living my life now. Is living my life now. It's living my life now. It's living my life now. In the name of Jesus. Father, I command that lizard, that lizard, that lizard, that lizard, that lizard, that lizard, that lizard die now. Die now. Die now. Die now. Die now. Die now. Die now, die now, die now, die now, die now, die now. Every lizard, 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 you are dying, you are dying, you are dying, you are dying, you are dying. You are dying. You are dying. You are dying. Right now. Right now. I command that lizard to die. That lizard dies now. That lizard dies now. That lizard dies now. That lizard dies now. That lizard dies. Masato Keteleba. That lizard dies now. Every snake. Every snake in your life is leaving you now is leaving you now is leaving you now is leaving you now shout jesus say 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 jesus in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Masata Korapele Kaba. Every spirit that has been manifesting in your life as reptiles, 
Langandi Mongo Nika Wanda Kunduli Kaba. I declare war on every spirit represented by reptiles in your life. These are the children of God. You have no place in their lives. You have no place in their lives. This is the house of God. This is the temple of the Holy Spirit. I order you now, get out of their lives, get out of their homes, get out of their bodies, in the name of Jesus. swallowed up your riches swallowed up your money swallowed up your destiny it is over 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 vomit it now vomit it now vomit it now Vomit it now! Vomit it now! Vomit it now! I cast it out of their belly! I cast it out of their belly! I cast it out of their belly! I cast it out of the belly! I cast it out of the belly! I cast it out of the belly! Mandangundu Likeba! Say, my body is the temple of the Holy Spirit. Korianda liba turukaba. Every ritual. Every ritual. Mangandundingi nyango lungrumba na peha. Father God rekoto la pirienema. Kaluzi dingi mango na riko dolibaka. Gambandingi jukula kereba. Renga butu siri yegema landinga manindo mbunguteha karengi di putali hisekaba ronga piri tele lukuruba ngandi piri yata kaliu shahayaba lengati yango hosege kinga nama kaliu gubretaba nganda pridi koto laba Father God, like you said in your word, the sword of the Lord and the sword of Gideon has come to smash them. the Midianites every Midianites that has been eating from you every harvest in your life it eats every harvest it takes away what is coming to you when you're about to get a breakthrough something comes and interrupts it Right now, I break it off your life. 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 In the name of Jesus, I come against the spirit of the grave. I come against the spirit of the grave. I come against the spirit of the grave. I come again in the spirit of the grave. Let my people go. Let my people go. Let my people go. Let my people go. I come again in the spirit of death. I come again in the spirit of death. Every spirit that has been killing things in your life, killing your business, killing your relationship, killing your life, Right now, I order it. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Go! 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 Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! In the name of Jesus, let my people go. Let my people go. Let my people go. Let my people go. 
Masato Keteba. Premature death lives your life now. Premature death lives your home now. Premature death lives your business now. Premature death lives your children now. In the name of Jesus. 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 Landangando Mengataraba. Lasato Kereba. Father, you say it in your word. Langiri Barakeba. If I cast out devils by the fingers of God, then the kingdom of God has come. Right now, in the name of Jesus, whatever you ate, whatever you drank, whatever you wore, that brought bondage in your life is living your life now. It's living your life now. It's living your life now. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! There is power, power. Jesus, 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 Jesus. Lift those hands, lift those hands. Say by the power of the blood. Say by the power of the blood of Jesus. Say by the power of the blood of Jesus. I bring to an end every work of the Spirit that draws me back. Say by the power of the blood of Jesus. I bring an end to every work of the enemy that draws me back this very afternoon. I receive my deliverance. 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 Come again as every sickness, every disease, bone disease, blood disease, organ disease, whatever ailment is in your body. I come again as the spirit of infirmity. I come again the spirit of infirmity. You must leave your body. waits on you. No one waits on you, Lord. The spirit of shame, the spirit of reproach, 
has been hanging over your life I see it being crushed into pieces in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus Jesus, Jesus. You may be seated in his presence. You feel me? Jesus. Jesus. Jesus, I will be brief. Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. 
Pastor Joshua, thank you so much for inviting me. It's my first time to be here. It's an amazing place. It's an amazing place. Jesus. Colossians chapter 1. Colossians chapter 1. From verse number 15. Christ is the invisible image. For anything was created. Is supreme over all creation. For through him, God created everything. In the heavenly realms, on the earth, he made the things that we can see. And the things we cannot see, such as thrones, kingdoms, rulers, and authorities in the unseen world. Everything was created through him and for him. Everyone say everything was created for him and through him. I haven't heard you say that. He existed before anything else. And he holds all creation together. He holds all creation together. He holds all creation together. Everything in life is held together by him. Christ is the glue that holds everything. Everything in your life together. He is the magnet that draws everything that is of you to yourself. Jesus made a statement. He said, when I am lifted up, when I am lifted up, I will draw all men to me. Say, when Jesus is lifted. Now, I want to teach you some things. Very simple. I share this almost everywhere I go. The primary reason why God gave you a mouth is not for eating. We can feed you intravenously. Authority is released through what? One man of God said, Thank you. One man of God said, a closed mouth is a closed destiny. If you don't learn to talk, you can have nothing in life. The words or your voice is your address in the spirit. You are identified with your voice. In fact, with advanced technology, there are cars that 
that are voice activated. You just stand by the car and say, open. And it opens. You say, start. It starts. Because your voice is unique to you. It is like a fingerprint. And so it becomes your address in the spirit. So if you don't talk, your miracle can go to your neighbor. So I encourage you, make use of your mouth. Even God, when he wanted to see something, he had to talk. He thought it, but he had to talk. You cannot think yourself into your breakthrough. You speak yourself into your breakthrough. So make use of your mouth always. Every time you come in the house of the Lord. Hallelujah. I say hallelujah. Tell him, I say neighbor, your voice is your address. Your voice is your address. So the Bible says, when Jesus is lifted up, he will bring all people to himself. The pastor shared with me briefly, you have been in time of prayer and seeking the face of the Lord to deal with this funny spirit of a setback spirit. Jesus yes. is the magnet that holds everything together. I want you to listen to me. Every time you lift up Jesus, he will draw to you whoever needs to come to you. He did not say, call people. What he said, lift me up. When I am lifted, the help you want will come to you. When I am lifted, every person God ordained to be in your life, he is the glue that attracts things to you. So your primary task is to do what? Lift Jesus up. Lift Jesus up. Lift Jesus up. Every time you lift up Jesus, the devil will locate his level. Because Jesus and the devil cannot be in the same place at the same time. Everywhere Jesus showed up, even a man who had been mad for so many years. When Jesus showed up, the devil had enough sense to worship Jesus. He went and worshiped Jesus in his mad state. If a madman can worship the Lord, what about you? Say, Holy Spirit, please help me. So wherever Jesus shows up, demons will submit. Wherever Jesus shows up, the help you need will show up. You remember the story of Peter? Remember, I just read a scripture. Everything was created through him and for him. Peter had a bad night. Luke chapter 5. He said, he told Jesus, I toiled the whole night. And I caught nothing. The whole night. Caught nothing. When Jesus showed up, he stood in his boat. The fish had enough sense that all things were created through him and for him. So when he stood in the boat, 
the fish assembled to listen to the sermon. Are you hearing me? When that finished listening to the sermon, when they finished listening to the sermon, he said, Peter, they are there. Wherever Jesus shows up, whatever is not will be. Your primary work or your primary work is to do what? Lift Jesus. I say lift Jesus. Just lift Jesus. He will take care of whatever you don't understand. Hallelujah. I say hallelujah. I say hallelujah. He said in the most, one of the most common scriptures quoted, Matthew 6, 33. Can somebody tell me? Seek ye first the kingdom of God and what? And his righteousness and what will happen? All these things shall be added. What is the kingdom of God? The kingdom of God doesn't come by observation. It is a spiritual thing. In fact, Jesus said, the kingdom is within you. Say the kingdom is within me. Tell, say the kingdom is within me. So what is the kingdom? The Bible says in Colossians that we have been translated from the kingdom of darkness to the kingdom of his dear son. So the kingdom we have received is the kingdom of his son. So who is the king? I say who is the king? I say who is the king? Who is the king? So whom do we seek? I say whom do we seek? We seek Jesus. In short, it is says, seek Jesus and his ways of doing things. Seek the kingdom of God and its righteousness. And what will happen? All these things. You see, things have enough sense to know they were created for Jesus. They have common sense. The Bible says the Gentiles wake up every day to look for these things. You must wake up every day to look for Jesus. Are you hearing me? Because when you seek Jesus, the Gentiles who seek after these things and they get it, the Bible says, this thing shall be added to you. Who will bring them? The Gentiles who are seeking after them. You don't understand this. Hello. So your work, seek Jesus. Lift him up. Sanctify him in your heart. Look at him and say, neighbor. Say, neighbor. simple word before I close. Brothers and sisters. Jesus yes. has never failed anybody. You would never. 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 You can go wrong with your appointment. But Jesus. But Jesus. Lazarus. 
Lazarus died on Jesus. He died not for Jesus, he died on Jesus. Jesus told him, Go tell this sickness is not unto death. But Lazarus went ahead and died. You haven't understood. A prophecy went through Jesus. Say, so God tell the sickness is not unto death. But Lazarus went ahead and died on Jesus. So when he died, Jesus told his disciples, Lazarus is sleeping. Let me go and wake him up. But there were carnal men who were around him. The Peters and the friends. Jesus told them, okay. He's dead. So I'm going back. And they told him, Jesus, but sit down. We escaped with our nose last time from that same place. Are we going back there to die? One of them said, let's go die with him. Read your Bible. To them, they were going to die. To Jesus, he was going to raise a man from the dead. He reached them. He said, let's go die with him. So even his partners in ministry, they had their own understanding. So Jesus walks into that place. The first person who shows up was Martha. Martha used to take water for bathing for Jesus. Because Jesus used to spend time at their home. So she went to Jesus. He said, Jesus, if you were here, my brother wouldn't have died. And Jesus told her, Martha, look at me. I'm not the one you take water for. I'm not the one you cook for food. The one standing in front of you is resurrection and life. You are used the Jesus who bathes. You are used to the Jesus who eats lunch. You are used to the Jesus who makes fun with you. But the one standing here now he is resurrection and life. And he said, Mother, the boy is coming back to life. And Mother said, I know. In the last days, Jesus just turned and said, This one is history. He said, Go call me Mary. Mary shows up. Said, Master, if you were here, my brother wouldn't have died. That's how you know they were attending the same church. But Mary did something that Martha didn't do. After she said what she said, where was she? She was at the feet of Jesus. She asked Jesus. She was at the feet of Jesus. Jesus, Pastor Joshua, what disturbed my peace that both sisters They make the same statement to Jesus. 
but they get different reaction from Jesus. Martha said, if you were here, my brother wouldn't have died. And Jesus went into summons. He began preaching to her. When Mary came and made the same statement, Jesus said, where have you laid him? There are people when they talk to God, say the same thing like you say, but they get different results from you. Martha led Jesus into a sermon. Mary took Jesus to the place of resurrection. Guess who showed up at the mouth of the grave? Who was there? Martha. Jesus said, remove the stone. What did Martha say? It is never. Martha, who told you to come here? Martha, didn't I tell you if you believe, Pastor, when did Jesus preach that sermon to Martha? Because I don't see the record. That means there was some silent conversation Jesus held with Martha. That is not written there. Martha, I told you, just believe and you will see the glory of God. Tell you never say, neighbor, just believe and you will see the glory of God. Just believe and you will see the glory of God. So they rolled away the stone. They rolled away the stone. And Jesus said, Lazarus, why did you die on me? Do you know everything serves me? Now death. Death. Listen. Resurrection and life is here. Can I tell you something? Do you know that Jesus made this statement before he died and resurrected? He functioned in resurrection power before even resurrected. You haven't got it. Say, Holy Spirit, please help me. And he called out. The grave had the voice of Jesus. Death had the voice of Jesus. And they held a conversation. Say, hey, the master is speaking. Let's leave the soul of this man to go back. Death and the grave told Lazarus, get out of here before, before Jesus comes. Get out of here before Jesus shows up. You haven't understood. Lazarus came out and Jesus handed him over. He handed him over to the people. Lazarus. Pastor, there is no spirit of setback that will hold what belongs to you in the grave. Nothing. This very day, 
the grave has vomited whatever belongs to you. Tell your neighbor, say, the grave has vomited everything that belongs to me. Say, my Lazarus, they are coming out tonight. Tell your neighbor, my Lazarus says, whatever represents Lazarus in your life. But you have one task. Your work is there. Remove the grave cloth from your miracle. Don't have much time for that, but I want to tell you. They thought Jesus had let them down. But Jesus came on time. Raise Jesus. Do you know that their home became a tourist attraction? Read your Bible. The Bible says everybody will come to see. They don't come empty handed. They came to see the miracle. The glory of resurrection cannot be compared to the glory of healing. Are you hearing me? They wanted him healed. Jesus wanted him raised from the dead. You are not late. God is on time. The glory of what is happening today is greater than what would have happened five years ago. Stand up on your feet. Say, Heavenly Father. Say, Heavenly Father. My life is in your hand. You are never late. You are never late. You are always on time. My life is not a mistake. My life is in face with your will, with your purpose. I thank you that my Lazarus is, that the enemy swallowed up. Today they are coming out of the grave. Come on, clap your hand to Jesus and appreciate him.